Yo! What up, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Yep, got the unit out here at Turkey Camp. Been hyping it up that we're gonna be doing a lot of turkey videos. We're here. We're back where we were burning. You can tell they're burning over yonder. Still, to this day, this is like two weeks after I came burning. Today. Oh, they just started this fire today? Yeah. What up? Afternoon. Good afternoon. I'm finally here. Ready to shoot some turkey? I am. I'm ready to get after it. Turkey camp has begun. I know. We got five to put on the ground. Five. Oh, we have to. Yeah, five to put on the ground. Two of the turkey winners. One, two, three. Yeah. Gonna and try Brad to might go one. And Brad might come, yeah. So, uh, I just showed up and girl's like, hey, let's just go try to get yours done. I'm like, I'm game for that. Yeah. You think it's going to be the hardest spot possible-ish? Yeah, I think so. It's new to us. We've only had it for like three or four years, and I haven't heard of much being on there. Neither has my dad. So uh, he seen huh? he seen him there just like two days ago, though. Uh, yeah, from the highway. So I don't know. We'll see. They're there. We'll kill one. Look, <laughs> Gerald. We'll kill one, Bob. So a little backstory: why we're out east and the Sand Hill Turkey Hunt giveaway. Why we're doing it out here is because at home we just don't have them. Mind you, when I pulled out of the driveway, a hen. 100 yards to the west, cross the road. <laughs> and then I, and then Wade called me 30 minutes later. He's like, well, seen the first turkeys in the backyard today. The long beard in the backyard? Uh, Wade said yes. Yeah. But well, he hadn't had them there all season, he exactly. said. Exactly. And then today I see one crossing the road by the house and then Wade. That'd be nice. It might be good by the time we Maybe. get back and out of here. We'll be done, though. We'll be done, though. Yeah, we'll, we might be able to go north and get one more, but... Turkey camp's begun. We're going to get under the way. I'm going to unload the side by side. We're going to get on the road. Probably just try to spot one and do a stock on them with a 12 gauge. Yeah. That or they've been like we've been driving around a lot. You don't really see them, but then you get back like off into the trees and you run into them. So I don't, I think they're kind of hanging tight into the trees right now. Yeah. Well, <clears throat> let's get after it, boys, and give her a go. Oh my God. What just happened? <laughs> we, uh, Got some birds to gobble with the others. Three more. Oh, <laughs> Four more. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, if this goes good, we'll be done here in the next 30 minutes. Yeah, so. hopefully it goes the way it's looking though. No, they're running. Those are jigs. So. so we just went by two big old to three toms. Three toms. Three toms. So, far. So, so let's go. We're just gonna, I'm gonna strap on the GoPro and we're yeah. gonna go. Perfect, let's, let's go. Got the old TSS. Yeah. And that's right. Uh, TSS loads. Old Federal. If you're looking for the honestly knockdown power, TSS. Uh, this is the situation. Gerald's got the two decoys and the double barrel 410. I got my 12 gauge with the shot cam. I really want to get a good turkey kill with the shot cam. I think it would look really cool. Oh, yeah. And if we can get it both done in one go, then we can just. Enjoy the next four days. Right. <laughs> Let's go. Stocks are fun. Spot you, Tom. <sighs> Sneak up on them. Sit out a couple decoys. Call. These birds have uh, been responding real well. Gerald said this morning he called a turkey all the way up to the cabin. I was catching crappie, <laughs> and he interrupted. <laughs> turkey out here dude. Unreal. Yo. Responded immediately. Let's just Okay. Okay. Alright, plan is we're gonna tuck in back here against this tree. Oh I love this style of hunting. This is awesome. They're going to hide back here, try to pull them across this fence. Straight in the deeks, boys and gals. 
cross your fingers wish us luck if you like the turkey videos uh like we said at the beginning we got uh me gerald brad preston and the turkey winners so six total five for sure six total so lots of videos to come y'all oh that's a good sitting spot right there Give her a go, boys. Let's give her a go. Those jakes just gobbled right there. Yeah. But the toms are farther back. We might have to give them a minute to settle down since we drove in and kind of keep creeping up on them. <clears throat> we, we drove by a second group. A bunch of jakes out in the middle of the, the field here and they push pretty hard so we're gonna be gentle with it take our time let's move to the corner okay. well seems like the birds are kind of pushing with the wind away from us since we drove in we probably accidentally freaked them out a little bit uh, so we're gonna take our time be as quiet as possible and try to move in on them Delicious luck, man. This is beautiful. Like, like Gerald said, um, at home he drove 2,500 miles to try to get his dad a bird, and then within 100 miles, you roosted nine birds. It's pretty impressive. Yeah, it's awesome. I mean, we're, I'm two hours away from home, for sure, out east. An hour and a half. Yeah. Hour and a half. That's the way it goes. At home. It's really getting a lot scarcer every year it seems like but out here oh boy look at that double barrel action you got going on there This is awesome. Yeah, they can't be but 45, 50 yards away. Yeah, I'm gonna lose my mouth cold. <laughs> so much fun. Now it's just, oh, we got a hand right here. Right here. <laughs> oh, so many. Yeah. There's like a million. You might be able to cross, look at that down there. Or, yeah, right here ain't bad. Okay, well, we picked up new spot. I'm driving in the field, we spooked them birds up. Didn't know that they were even there. We're at a whole new spot. We've hiked in about half a mile, maybe. Uh, but we gotta cross this creek so we can get to some of these open fields. See if there's any turkey available to chase. 
telling you what, pressing your property is unreal out here. How did you do that? Did you just get real nimble on me or something? Oh, you went there? There we go. Oh my God. Ew. Who did that kind of freak you out? Yeah. Ew, what is it? Oh no, he's gross. Yeah, I don't know, he's gross. <laughs> I might step on Ooh, that's you why you kind of jump. see me jump? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. It's not like a oh, look at that big old fish right there. Is that a trout? No, there's no trout. Look at that right there. See it? I don't. Is that a gar? Oh, right there's a gar. That's a gar. Yeah. I'll be dad go. We need to come fishing down here. Big old gar. Huh. Little bass. Yeah. Yeah. Big bass. Wow. There was like 10 bass in there. Yeah. These little streams are stocked up. Man. We'll come fish this tomorrow. We're going to have to come. Yeah, we're coming and fishing tomorrow, boys. Well, we drove around the entire section. And we came in on the back side. We're only a couple hundred yards at most away from where we were. But now the birds are coming towards us. Hopefully. I'm trying to get ahead of them, but they got in a thick spot. Just hoping they're still coming right at us. We have no decoys. We've packed in a half mile. Let's see if we can call them to us and see what they're gonna do. We'll be patient. Going this way, call them again. He just went into the smoke into that tree. See a brush on him. I was looking hard. If he goes left, he's okay. We're still okay. Come on, walk left.
could not see his brush because of that log laying down. You stoned him, dude. <laughs> I knew it was definitely a bigger bird because he was right there. But all of these were jigs. I was like, dude, I can't tell. Yeah. I can't tell. That, uh, that log right there screwed me. Whatever, we got him. Got screwed up. Dude, he was literally... F that ain't even 15 yards right there. No, he was... And he I was could not... I could not see his... I could not see his god dang beard. That's awesome, dude. He almost lost that bird. <sighs> Couldn't see it. I'll show you why. Hey, look. Check it out. Are we done? Good to go? Or yeah, do you want to wait a minute? He's still floating around a little bit. But... Show him that log right there. Yeah. Like he was he was right there. I could have shot him way closer. So check this out. Down. I don't know if I got the shot cam on or not. Uh I don't know if it filmed. Um Yeah, he's flopping pretty good. We're gonna let him die here, but uh, so right here that bird came all the way up to this evergreen right here. And this log land down, which I'll I'll walk at it and show you, it is just the right height that I could not see his beard at all. Couldn't see it. I, I could have shot him at 15, 12 yards. About lost him. Patience is a virtue. Yeah. He wasn't sure. He didn't, <laughs> he didn't, he just seen something was yeah. here and he didn't like it. No decoy, but spot he, and stock, baby. He never moved. Yeah. No decoy, yeah, spot and stock. Too. Huh? Once he turned yeah. sideways, I seen that hand. Could not see his beard at all. Heck yeah. All right, here we go. I'll show you what's up. <laughs> So this is where I'm at, I'll walk at it. So right through here, I could have smoked him right here, but this log right here, he came all the way up here and turned and went back, but that log right there could not see his beard. <laughs> oh, dude, no decoy. That was a good plan. You put together a hell of a plan, brother. There. Awesome plan. <sighs> I wasn't waiting on him. No. He came out of the clearing. I was like, uh-uh. Well, he was walking out that way, and I was like, oh, look at the tree you annihilated to get him. <laughs> Plowed him over. He stayed at this big tree here for a while, posted up, and all we needed him to do was come out that far, and here he is. Put my put my gun down for a minute. I hope I got it on the shot cam. I'm not sure. He needed his neck wrung a little bit. Oh, not bad. It's not good bad. bird. Yeah, that is a good bird. That's a good. Yeah, good bird. Well, he's got two or three year old bird. There he is. There. Sweet. <laughs> Let's go get another one. Yeah. I'm done. Yeah. You're yeah. done. You're done till we go north. Yeah. All right, well, there she is. We're gonna get a picture real quick. Let's get a thumbnail for the old video. Yeah. Right here, and then we'll keep moving. Is it matching? No, it is. They're old, but... Sitting right here by our bird. Heck yeah. <laughs> oh, that's oh, awesome. That's so I'm glad I brought the 12 gauge, because almost- well, You could've got it with the 14. I think so, but I, I knew. Was, uh, I had the safety off. I was right Did back you? in. <laughs> well, there we go. All in. That's a good day's work. That's a good day's work. It's time for a drink. Brewski. Brewski time. Survey. Well, here, here we go. We got about a half mile pack out. I was telling myself, Bob, if you shoot one way in here, you're gonna have quite the pack out. It ain't bad. This is worth it. We did it, boys. Please, boys and gals, I would have much appreciated if you'd smash that thumbs up button for me. Uh, this is the start. It, our plan actually worked really well. Um, get my bird out of the way and then Gerald, Preston, Brad, and then our two turkey winners, uh, they'll be next. So going to have a lot of videos coming y'all's way. I cannot vlog and grab this camera off my head right now because I got my shotgun and my bird. So uh, how refreshing was that? Oh. Huh? First bird of the year. First bird of the year down. Yeah, buddy. An hour into your turkey season. <laughs> yeah. Now you just get to watch the show. Yeah, I know I get to film you guys having good hunts, hopefully. There we go. I can do that. Hold my gun. 
Darn it, man. Turkey hunting is so much fun. I remember a few years ago, you're like, Boff, let's just get after it. After you get your first one down, you'll understand. And last year with the crossbow was really cool. Hide you up there. Yeah. But coming, you know, two hours away from home and having to just put on the miles, not many miles, only an hour or two in here, we got her done. Well, it's fun. It's fun out here too, because we've never been here before. Ne exactly. That's what I'm getting at. You know, like at home, we'll be like, all right, there's usually a turkey around this corner. Right. Preston's never hunted this spot. We've never hunted this spot. Yeah. Made her happen. It was awesome. <clears throat> Gerald's idea of, hey, let's just sit right here and hopefully these birds hug the edge of this uh, tree belt. Perfect. That's exactly what they did. You actually called them at the perfect time. We almost lost them. Almost. They almost went by us. I thought they were gone. <laughs> I was like, we're done. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting hot out here, boys. Hi, yi, yi. What are you boys doing here, huh? came to say hi they met us all the way in there about half of the way of the walk out now you guys needed some water for refreshments so. yeah brought us some refreshments apparently we showed up right in time you did look at the snoozer on weren't, him weren't here for three minutes then saw a snapchat of a bird flapping there <laughs> <laughs> yeah i didn't need, even need the decoys today that was awesome that was our second gerald and i's second, second set. set when uh when we started the hunt i'm like man we need to do it like we did that one time where both of us shoot them at the same time it almost happened though it could have but all the rest were jakes that we could see oh, i about lost that bird man he about got away can't believe i couldn't see that darn beard on it. yeah that's a good one kiss it that's a good one it's a big bird dude yeah it is <laughs> that's a giant bird look at that big old bird well now it's your boys turn who's gonna be next i'm ready I want to look at Bradley. I'm ready to go look at this next property if we can quit messing around here. All right, we better go. <laughs> get them all going. Maybe we get two in one day, or three, or four. Who, who knows? Well, good thing you put your tracker on on X. What was it? A mile and a quarter. A mile and a quarter total, and that's coming back. So we only did about a half mile-ish going to him, mm -hmm. right? Roughly somewhere around there, yeah. Yeah, right out of, right out of half mile, walking to him and a half mile out. Not bad. That was easy. If the rest are that easy. So fun. <laughs> that was awesome, dude. So fun. I, you know, one difference from this year to last year, like last year I couldn't really control my adrenaline, you know? And it was probably because of the crossbow as well. But you did year. good, because when they popped up, I was like, I don't know what it is, and he's gonna roll it anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Which once, don't really matter. Yeah, I mean, once that bird started walking away and I could compare it to them jakes, I was like, oh, that's a huge bird. It had to have been a tom, and sure enough, he had first eyes on the beard, and boy, howdy, man. That was cool. That was cool. It doesn't, uh, that's how turkey hunting is. You might kill him on a decoy. You may not. Sometimes you may not need the decoy like that. We, hell, Gerald was like, you know what? We're going to have to walk, Bob. Let's just leave the decoys and take our guns. I was like, okay, well, we're definitely not going to shoot one. That was my first intuition. Never think that. Never think, especially Never. out here. That guy, that guy I hunt with in Missouri, we hardly ever use decoys. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, like, I like using decoys if it's open, like if you're in a field. Right. Um, but when we're, well, I guess, luckily, where we got into him, it was thick. Yeah. So, a lot of times, like with him, he always told me he don't like using them because it's real thick where we hunt in Missouri. And... They come looking, right. you know, so they're just looking. Right. Oh, old P. P. Diddy. Diddy wants to... P. Diddy wants to chat. Here's old P. Diddy. You guys want to go over to the Preston property, the one with the houses, and park there? We're going to run home and get a camera and get some pictures. Right on. You, uh, just leave your bird in the bed. We're going to hang it up, take some pictures with it. Okay. Sound good? Yep. Wait. Ew. Ah. Gerald and I just got back from his hunt uh you guys will see that oh it'll be the next video that goes up i'm sure because by tomorrow we cross our fingers hope that we have gerald's uh bird down tomorrow but we already had a great 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 first half of his hunt filmed it all and uh we're back oh i heard that that's where we're going <laughs> are you going over there right now no, down here. are you gonna go down in there 
anyways, we're gonna start grilling. Oh man, what a hunt. What a hunt, let me tell you. There he is, there's my bird right there. Got her tagged up, bearded up. Big ol' schnooter. <laughs> right behind the house. No, it sounded that way. Yeah, it's that way. I could have. I could have swore it was that way. They're, the boys are getting ready to go. Preston and Brad. I think he's back in there. Oh, he is over there. Like now it's over there. there. Over there, it sounds like. Yeah. What all you got? What are you doing? You got tripods, big old cameras, decoys. We're going to chase a turkey, I guess. Hey, what all do you got? We're just going to go film a turkey. You got the red too? Hey, we'll hide in the pit blind. Yeah. Well, we are back at the cabin. I have. Oh, man, I need the key. Darn it. I've already tried to start the outro of this first turkey hunt. Uh, this will be the third time. Gerald just killed his bird. Uh, full video to come, y'all. Uh, amazing video. <laughs> when I say amazing, you guys gotta watch it. You won't believe it. Gerald and I got it done the same day. Uh, what do you think, brother? That was incredible. Did that you one. did you get them coming down the hill? Yeah. Yeah, they'll see it. Coming that down the hill, that yeah. Was so insane. You all will see Gerald just shot his bird right here at the cabin. Y'all will see that on the next video, the next edition Sit. to the Turkey Camp series Sit. here. Sit. Uh, got mine done about three hours ago. Gerald just got his done about 30 minutes ago. I couldn't believe how fired up those <laughs> things were. Both of them. With the trucks being here and then having to cross the fence. If you would have just happened to take his gun after he was done, you could have killed your bird too. Oh, we could have, yeah. We could we could incorporate the footage out on my camera where you can see yeah. after he got it, that bird comes back and is just pecking yep. at its head where it had been. We didn't even think about it. We were both so, we were both fired up over there. Me and Preston, so this will be on the next video. Gerald got his bird. You guys got to watch it. It is Adrenaline City. Preston and I were sitting in the truck watching it all go down. Brad filmed it on his camera. I filmed it on my camera. Be expecting some awesome videos, some amazing videos yet to come from the Turkey Camp series. We have the two Turkey Camp uh, winners that'll be here tomorrow. So we'll probably, like we're gonna get it done on our side before they get here and we're saving birds for them. Like some of the good birds. Just what? amazing how many birds are out here. Yeah, incredible. What, two hours in? Literally, even yeah. that haven't even hardly hours. went and explored that much. Crazy, but thank y'all for being here. Y'all have uh, been requesting turkey hunts, guys. Like I'm saying, we're hitting it hard. Uh, going to be pumping out the turkey vids for y'all. Don't miss them. Do not miss them. Um, we got the. We haven't even got the can am off the trailer, y'all. Well, here you are. <laughs> Gerald's already cleaning his bird. That's what I got to do. I am uh, gonna put down the camera and get to cleaning myself. There, there he is. I accidentally cut the third beard off. Oh, the third beard? Yeah, there's the second one. Uh huh. There's the third. Whisker biscuits, but it yeah, counts. It does count. So y'all got to uh, stay tuned for the next video to see Gerald throw down. What an epic, just spur of the moment. Completely, we were done. Yeah. We were just coming here to cook brats. Yeah, and then this happened. Beautiful bird. Adrenaline packed. Uh, but, gotta catch my breath. <laughs> we'll see y'all on the next one. Oh, Carol's gonna smoke it, dude. Look, he's getting ready. Does he have a fork? Oh, here he goes. Nope. Cause I've been getting laid back, baby. You should know that I don't need your criticism, pay.